to Why Night with Lynette. I am Jay Lynette, the best friend that everyone deserves. And I'm here today with, of course, our wine of the week, Taylor Port Wine. This wine is a moderately sweet red wine, ranked in the 19th percentile in the entire world and in the 10th percentile in the United States. This wine right here is bottled and made right in the good old US of A in New York. Port wine typically comes from Portugal. Taylor Vineyards does have a port wine that is made in Portugal, but this particular bottle, like I said, is made in New York. So, can y'all believe that this wine is only $5.99 and it has 18% alcohol? Now this wine came highly recommended by my best friend, Courtney, and I'm so ready and eager to try it. I've heard really good things about the wine overall. I feel like I've tasted this before, maybe a few years ago, and I didn't, I don't know, get a good judgment on it. So I'm really excited to try it today. This is a dessert wine, and it's preferred served chilled or at room temperature. It's all up to your preference. All right, y'all, so you know what time it is. Let's go ahead and taste. I always have a little struggle opening the bottles, but this is a twist top. Come on now. All right, here we go. I did choose to drink my wine chilled. I typically like drinking chilled wines. It's pretty much my preference when it comes to wine drinking. I do not really like room temperature wines at all. So here we are. Just at first glance and observation, I can already tell this is a richer wine than the wines that we've had before, simply because it's already, it's very, appears thick and has a lot of buoyancy as well. I'm nervous and excited to try it though. 18%. Ah, all right, so here we are. Cheers. Hmm. Wow, not bad at all. Honestly, not bad at all. Um, yeah, this is actually quite tasty. Um, I'm definitely picking up on the moderately sweet. It's very sweet when you first drink it. As the wine goes down, you get a more of a little, just a hint of bitter, but it's not bad at all. It does not have a bad aftertaste. Um, and <clears throat> I've had a few drinks in my life before. So when things are a little bit higher in alcohol content, it kind of heats up your insides a little bit. And my insides are getting a little bit warm if I do say so myself. This wine is made with Concord grapes and I very much can taste the the richness of the grapes as well. It really, hmm. I'm, I'm quite enjoying this wine, y'all. I, I really am. Like, the more I drink it, the more I enjoy it. It tastes as though they hand-picked each grape before they put it in the barrels to be made into wine. And I mean, this is great. This is great. This is honestly my first time really drinking this wine. I feel like I've had this wine somewhere before a, a few years back and I just, I guess I didn't get a real good taste or maybe it was warm. It probably was warm and I just didn't enjoy it. I definitely recommend chilling it. I can see how if this is warm or room temperature, you probably wouldn't enjoy it. But chill it and it's, it's really good, y'all. It's really good. So I'm definitely going to have to give this a 9 out of 10 WAP stars. 
simply because, you know what? I'm actually gonna give it a 10 out of 10 wop stars. I really am. I'm gonna have to give this a 10 out of 10 because this wine, number one, it tastes really great. It's not too sweet and it's tasty as well. It has a very rich taste to it. I read somewhere that someone said it almost tastes like what a ruby should taste like. It's very rich, it's powerful, it's sweet, yet a hint of just like, mm. just to make sure you know like, hey, I ain't nothing to play with. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm definitely going to probably give this a 10 out of 10 this time because, yes, great alcohol content, 18%. That's higher than most wines that I've had on this show. Um, taste is amazing. Um, very much great. Yes, I, I have no complaints. Oh, as well as... The price, I paid $5.99 for this wine, y'all. $5.99, and this is a pretty big bottle. With this much alcohol content and a great taste, I feel like you can't beat this. And I know sometimes it's so hard for us to find a good red wine. This is a good red wine. I'm really happy about this. I really am. I'm gonna have to recommend this for communion. Like, this is great. Honestly, like, this is really great. I'm... I'm very much satisfied with this. Courtney, thank you so much for the recommendation because this is a 10 out of 10 for me. Fantastic, honestly. Well, <sighs> mm chef's kids because who <laughs> well i hope you all enjoyed my review i definitely recommend that you go out and get this wine the taylor wine company's new york sport wine great wine i have no complaints about the wine guys great price great alcohol content and great taste you can't beat it and before i go i just really want to thank everyone who participated in my uh, wine giveaway. Miles Hammock did win the wine giveaway. I will be doing giveaways every 50 subscribers. Our next goal is 200 subscribers. So if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button so we can grow, 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 and grow. And the more we grow, the more you know. Okay? <laughs> so this has been Wine Night with Wynette. I am Jay Wynette, the best friend that everyone deserves. And see y'all. I thought it was empty. <laughs> See y'all next week, okay? <laughs>